Did you know, did you know that 68% of the viewers we have on this channel have not subscribed? If you want to be one of the 31.9% green people, please click that subscribe button. It really helps us grow and I thank you from the bottom of my heart. So today, today we're playing Naughty Ones. Naughty Ones is on the Amiga, and I had a quick go of this, and it looks like a rather cute platform game. And why did I pick it? I picked it because I couldn't think of what else to play, and I thought, you know what, let's do something on the Amiga. And I loaded up the glorious, the glorious Mr. FPJ, and I found this particular game. I hope it's going to be good as the first few moments of it that I actually played, but we will see as we go on a journey together. So here it is, just loading in. You saw no signal briefly there, and look at that sound. Interactive Vision presents. What does it present? I hope it presents Naughty Ones. Naughty Ones, a melon design game. And look at those little boys, they've got sunglasses on. Okay, on a sunny afternoon, the two naughty brothers, John and Jim, were playing with their rubber balls in their fields near their home. Okay, what's going to happen? Here we go. Uh, the summer holidays had begun and they were jumping around with no other worries in life than who they were going to tease when all the school teachers were away on vacation. Hmm. At least there was no mention of woodland porn there. But all of a sudden the sky darkened, the birds stopped singing and a chilly wind swept over the landscape. Yes! Yes, it was night. No, it probably wasn't night. Okay, a powerful beam lift up everything around them and gravity seemed to change direction. They actually look a little bit like South Park characters, don't they? You know, with their wide open mouths. In a whirlpool of colours and light, the two brothers kept falling, completely losing track of time, place and dimension. They were captured in a surreal reality and nobody was going to help them get him back into this world except you, hopefully. This is some Alice in Wonderland vibes that's going on here, but they've still got their sunglasses. So here we are, Naughty Ones, Naughty Ones. Created by Melon Design, let's start the game. So I'm hitting fire. No, I'm hitting fire there. Well, time to prove your skills in the world of man mechanics. Good luck. Mechanics? Mechaniacs? I don't know what that word is. Alright, so we're one player and we're this guy here. And we got a little ball that we can throw. And our object is to get to that key on the right hand side. And when we get that key, that door will open. I don't know why there's an arrow on the top guy by the floppy disks. I really, really don't. Pushing up to jump. We're gonna do this slowly, slowly. So if I can hit you with my lightning, come on. Oh, okay, I'll use the lightning. That's how you do it. You bounce the ball and you get a scream, and then you get a token to collect. And it's as simple as that. Obviously, the first screen is gonna be dirt simple, even so easy that the gentleman can do it from the gentleman's pixel club. All right, can I get the bottom one from here? Yes! Obviously I'm not going to get the big robot from here, but that doesn't matter. Alright, let's not get hit by the crane. And down we go. Ooh! Then he jumped to my death. So yes, you've seen me, you've seen me probably do a first screen perfectly without dying. For the first time ever on this channel. If you're new to this channel, by the way, we generally play games without knowing what we're doing. So it's an exploring experience beyond anything else. Um, so you, you really, really do get first impressions of what's going on. So here we go. Here we go. Oh, look at this. Right, we got lasers. We got inverted bins. We've got dusty bins. Do you know dusty bin? We've got dusty bins. All right. Okay, that trick still works. Alright, I think we've got to get that screwdriver. Okay, yeah. Now, try and jump onto there. Yes, we're learning. Okay, we can go across there easily. But I really don't know why we have that little red, that little arrow on the top guy. Oh, I was trying to do a jump to the left. Oh, come on. All right, click that coin. Oh, what is going on? Why can't I get to him? Oh, 
Alright. This is gonna be a bit of a ball ache here. Right, can I not do this big jump? Oh, I can do it. Alright, got that coin. We seem to be able to fall quite well. Alright, I reckon that bounces down there. Actually, no, look, there's a switch up there. Oh, shit! How did I not see that? How did I not see where that was shooting me from? Okay, and that was the optimal way up there that I didn't get right. right I'm trying to kill the bottom guy here. Alright, it's going to be a double jump, I think. Okay, that. Okay, the exit's up there. All right, I was gonna say that seems to work. I was expecting to exit from the bottom for some reason, and we did it. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, we didn't even kill all the enemies. We're that good. Okay, you can jump through the top platforms just a little bit. So that helps. Okay, we're probably going to die getting that bottom one, but I see no alternative. Okay, well, that was a waste of a life, wasn't it? Oh, we've got lightning. Right. Now, lightning, I shot again to see whether lightning went through. Ah, oh, six. Okay, well, lightning helps. Yeah, you can go back and kill on previous screens. All right. Maybe I can land on its head and kill that one. Because it's got an arrow. No, I can't. Damn it. How'd you get down? Oh, no, 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 no. That screen is horribly hard. All right, we're going to try again. All right, G. P C There we go, 16,900 That was alright, that was fun Alright, let's try and get through this a little bit quicker this time Take me higher Oh, you jumped up, you shit Oh, I couldn't get that one in time. Oh, what was I doing? That all went a bit wrong. Right, oh, come on. There you go, perfect shot. Got your coin. Got that. Alright, let's try and do this level a little better. Oh, close. that guy there. Lovely, lovely. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We've got to do a lot more thinking about the next level. Come on, one more. One more good shot. There you go. Get the key. Right, 
Right, so we've got to shoot and jump to the right. Oh, I get it! Oh, he was too close. I get it! Bomb Jack! So it shows you what order it wants you to kill them in. But how can we get down this? It's something to do with the crane, I think. That little bit there. does make no sense. Can we run it? No, that didn't help. That didn't help. Ah, oh, this is the way to do it. Well, I'm not going to kill them in... Oh, shit, sticks. I'm not going to kill them in the right order by going this way, but there's nothing else I can do. Timing. All right, let's try and get to the heart. We've got to get to the heart on the left-hand side. Okay, nice. We're alive. Okay, the exit has opened up. Oh, we nearly died there, didn't we? Ah, oh, for frick's sake. I double jumped. You push up here on the Amiga to jump. All right, okay. This is good, this is good. We know what we're doing. G. P. C. Okay, 21,200. 21, All right, so yeah, those, those little arrows... I've got to be the order it wants you to kill them in. Which is going to be rather stressful to try and do. We might be able to do it. We might be able to do it. Let's give it a go. Let's give it our best shot. Fuck. Sorry, language for fiddles, for fiddles. Right. I'm just looking at the top row because it's all about... Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. It's all about getting that one in the right position. And they move so fast. The guy, uh, this is, could be a one or two player game. Um, and uh, I believe the second player is going to be in blue. So we're in red. Oh, here we go. Yes. I did it. I did it. Kill myself. I've got to kill myself. I wouldn't usually do that, but I want to get back to that guy to kill him in that order. So we've killed everything in the right order. Hopefully, it will give us like a tremendous 500 bonus lives. do is kill one more thing. Two more things, two more things. We've got the guy at the bottom. How can I miss you? 
All right, okay, let's go to the bottom. Let's go to the bottom now. Yes! Big bonus. Big bonus, I think. Oh, we're not doing that shit again. So, this guy will give gold coins when he dies, because he died in the right order. He'll give me gold. He'll give me uh, purple. There we go, we're learning. Open the door. Oh, run away from that. One life left. Well, that's what happens when you experiment. It looks like the arrows are random as well. Did you see how quickly we moved? Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, we moved so quick and we got ourselves killed. So 21,600. All right. I think that that is the highest score we've got so far. 21,600, yes it is, by 400 points. We're having one more go of this, a final go of this. I like this. I still had my lightning, so I was dilly dallying there um, to, because I, I had to land on the ground to hit him with the lightning. But it looks like I might have had my balls rather than the lightning. All right, okay. We know we've got balls now. I should have probably just tried that. Right, when we got them in the right order, this robot... Ah, oh, damn it! So it wasn't a mega bonus. The robot gave the three that it gave before. Oh, I like the way you can go back into previous screens, by the way. Um, when you screw it up like I do. twice there. Alright, let's see whether, just for a learning curve, let's see whether we'll die with one hit now. Yeah, right, so the damage you do to the enemies, it remembers, which is kind of good. So if it's got five hit points and you get rid of a couple of them, those couple will remain persistent um, and you only have to get rid of three. Rolled into that screen. Our last life, 1300. How far can we go? Probably not far enough. Right, we've got one life. Double cannons. Oh, we're safe for the double cannons for the time being. Oh, he shoots. He shot at me. You know what? We'll go through here. Oh, I'm bollocked straight into that and killed myself. 
all right i've had fun playing this i've had fun playing this this is a lower score this is a lower score so g p c yeah that's one of the much lower scores that we got but yeah i've absolutely had fun playing this the Mr. FPJ is a great system. It allows us to play all great platforms. You know, this is Naughty One's being played on the recreated Amiga. You know, and it's great to be able to bring a game from, yeah, it's from 1994, this game. So, what's that? Yeah, that's 30 years. Holy hell. That game is three decades old. Doesn't it make you feel old? All of you stay safe. All of you take care. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.